What's up everyone? Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Before we begin, make sure to hit the like and subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button which is the bell icon. We're posting 4 videos every day so make sure to check back every single day. We're aiming for 20k subscribers and get a deal in the description if you haven't already. This is not financial advice. Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Let's begin. What's up guys, so just before we begin, make sure to hit the subscribe and bell icon. People aren't seeing our content and that's probably because you haven't hit the bell. Thank you again for all your support. We're so proud of the amazing community that we've built. So we're just taking a look at Elrond and as we can see, it does look as though it's coiling up very, very nicely indeed. We've basically got a little bit of a pattern looking something like this. If we just draw these lines in, we've got obviously a little bit of resistance like this. We've got some support looking something like this and it does look as though, you know, you know, potentially we've got this very nice upward trend that we've been in for a while. We've obviously got this downtrend that we're stuck under as well. And it looks as though we do potentially look like we're calling up for a bit of a move here. As we've been saying for the past few days, we are coiling quite nicely in and around this area here at around 230 ish dollars. If we throw the Fib retracement on here as well, we can get a better idea about what's going on. But just put this on like this. We can get another idea about what's going on here. Obviously, we ran. <clears throat> We've absolutely respected these fib levels like an absolute beast, by the way, all the way up. You can see them quite clearly here. Broke the all-time high, hit that psychological $300 level. Everyone took profits. We rolled all the way back over to find support on the 078 here, along with the 55 moving average on our daily time frame. Looking very bullish. We've got that bounce to the upside, but we're stuck under this resistance, aren't we? And we're still stuck here. This resistance line heading down here. Firstly, it was around 290 ish dollars. We come back up to around 250. That previous all time high stuck under this downtrend. So then we roll over again. We retest this, um, the bottom of somewhat of this trend. We get this big, big wick back to the upside. Things looking quite bullish. We're holding the 20 moving average here. And you know, it looks as though Elrond wants to break to the upside, doesn't it? And if we do start to break out of this level here, this resistance and retest it as support, then we could be looking at a very nice price target for Elrond pretty soon. But there's really not much else to say apart from that. Obviously, over the past few weeks, things have been pretty bearish because we've been in September and there's been a lot of FUD and a lot of, you know, bearishness in general just because it's September. But, but we do think overall that Elrond is looking extremely bullish right now. It's holding support really nicely and we do expect it to have a very nice little run up pretty damn soon. So we'll keep things short and sweet then and look at short and term price predictions. If we do roll over from here, we'd expect, you know, the bottom of this trend line here down here around 200 ish dollars to hold. <laughs> Along with this previous level of a uh, resistance here flipped into support as you can see we did wick down onto this area and get the bounce and if we do start to break out of this area here and then come back down and retest and break to the upside then do expect that we'll be coming back towards this all-time high of 300 dollars and then maybe beyond in the next few weeks if we do see that breakout to the upside like this and then going into the remainder of the bull run we've obviously got some nice targets here we've got the 127 at around 380 dollars we've got the 141 at around 450 what is 466 dollars the 161 at around $631. And then obviously we've got the, that B227 extension at $1,700. And we do think at least $1,000 for Elrond, considering how well it's performed recently, is quite likely in our opinion, which is around a 4X from the current price. So that's it, guys. We'd like to thank everyone so much for their support. If you've got any questions or suggestions, please leave them down below. And don't forget to subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button, which is the bell icon to stay up to date with the four videos that we post every single day. Remember, if you want to support the channel more directly and get a ton of benefits and insight, as well as joining our growing community, consider the Patreon or YouTube membership down below. You can also sign up to our free Telegram via the description as well. All the links are in the description for affiliate links for discounts and free crypto, so go check them all out below. There's plenty of goodness on offer. Please like and subscribe. We are Crypto Maximalist.